Well, yesterday and Friday, we were stuck in the upper 70s. Today, we made it into the 80s. 85 degrees was the high temperature today in Eugene. The average for this time of year now at 79 degrees. So our temperatures are now well above that. And we are only going to see our temperatures climb as we head into the next week. Here's a look at high temperatures across the rest of the area where we're also seeing the heat today. Uh, we saw a high of 88 degrees in Roseburg, 75 in Bend, 77 in Redmond. Corvallis also getting up into the mid 80s. I think 84 was your high temperature today. 73 in North Bend and 68 in Newport. But take a look at Brookings down in the southwestern uh, corner of the state. 92 degrees there. Very warm temperatures. And let's just say that is where our temperatures are headed once we get into the week. Here's a look at our current temperatures, though, have cooled off a few degrees from our highs today. 70s along uh, central Oregon. 67, though, at Odell Lake near Willamette Pass. Looking at those mid 80s along I 5 in central Oregon, or excuse me, along the coast, looking at temperatures in the upper 60s and even low 60s up into Newport and into North Bend. As we take a look at our satellite and radar across the state, as you can tell, we pretty much don't have anything going on. Plenty of sunshine from east, western Oregon all the way to eastern Oregon. Just a few light clouds out along the coast. Those will move inland as we head into tonight, so you will start off your Monday along the coast with the fog, but everywhere else will start off with that sunshine. Here's a look at where that system is that brought us the showers and storms on Thursday. It's been a slow mover to get out of the Pacific Northwest, still bringing some heavy rain, gusty winds, and even hail to Portland of Montana, but that is going to continue to work on off to the east, something we don't have to worry about. What we are focused on is high pressure. It's located uh, just to our south and west off the coast of California, and this has moved in. It is going to stick around through the next week, and it's going to keep our skies mostly sunny, and we're also going to tap into some very warm air into Southern California as we head into Tuesday and Wednesday. And that warm air is going to work its way up the coastline. And we are going to look at some very warm temperatures. The hottest day expected to be Tuesday. Along the coast, this is where we normally keep things mild. So upper 60s, low 70s for your Monday afternoon. Mostly sunny skies throughout the day tomorrow. Still slightly breezy as well. Looking at those low to mid 70s all the way through about Thursday. Keeping the sunshine. It's not until we head into the weekend. We add a few more clouds in and cool off into the upper 60s. I'm um, Cobason. Highs near 90 degrees tomorrow. Plenty of sunshine throughout the day. Mid 90s on Tuesday, hottest day, 95 degrees there. We'll slightly cool off by Wednesday and then we'll stay though in the 90s through Thursday. 70s over the passes, 80s in the foothills, a sunny warm and warm day in the Cascades. Sunny and warm also in Central Oregon, mid 80s expected in the afternoon tomorrow, but upper 80s for Tuesday and Wednesday. For the Valley, expect plenty of sunshine as well. We're not going to start off with that fog like we did this morning. We'll have what we call offshore flow, so the air moving from the land over the ocean instead of vice versa. When we see uh, the other way around, we usually see the fog. So tomorrow, not seeing the fog. That's going to allow temperatures to climb a few more degrees than today. And then we're looking at those 90s. 92, the hottest day on Tuesday. And then we'll slightly cool off Wednesday. Still 90 degrees there. It's not until we head into the weekend. We pick up a few more clouds and also slightly cooler air. Temperatures will fall back into the mid-80s. But once again, Jessica, as summer still holding on, the average for this time of year is 79 degrees. And for the week ahead, we're anywhere between 5 and 10 degrees above that very warm air stick around. It's going to be toasty. Yes. <laughs> All right. Thanks, Marissa. No problem.